What is going on guys, Snack God here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be sharing with you guys a way to resell sneakers to make $250 a week, and that's in profit. So, this is actually different than the way that I showed you guys how to resell sneakers in the past, and what this method is called is brick flipping, alright? So, let's begin with what are bricks. So, you may hear of hype sneakers or limited edition sneakers before, but bricks are kind of the opposite of that. They're the widely released common shoes, outlet shoes that you see sitting on stores. Uh, maybe you might see them sitting on your Nikes or shoe palaces or, you know, premium outlets. Or maybe you find them at Champs sometimes. But these are the shoes that you commonly see that usually aren't always sold out and you can get at a really good price. And what you do is you combine these with codes that get you even under retail prices and you resell them for a small profit. So let me just give you an example. We have a Nike box right here, and this is the Nike uh, Blazers. So these are actually like the mids, but anyways, these retail for $100, and with codes and buying them on the right site, and I'll get to that later on, you can get this for under a retail, which is basically about like $81. And then you also have to download a new program that allows you to get cash back basically on every single purchase, making it even cheaper. So you want to subtract the cash back from the total paid to actually get the real amount that you paid for this. So this shoe, it was $81, but the cash back was $15. So basically I paid around $65 for the shoe. Remember retail is $100 and on eBay, I could probably sell the shoe for at least $70 and up. So I was trying to make a little bit of money. So you guys can see the difference between selling hype shoes and bricks. This shoe could make me five, 10, five, 10, $15 probably, maybe more if I waited longer, but I would aim for around 10 to $15 per shoe if I'm doing a brick flip. However, on the other hand, I will be paying more money for a hype shoe and aiming for a higher margin, kind of making it also harder because when you flip a hype shoe, there's many things that you gotta factor in. Different sizes cost different values. Different people want different shoes. These are just general shoes you can post on anywhere. Like anyone could buy this. It's a really casual shoe that anyone can rock. Whereas the other hand, people may not have as much money to buy these kinds of shoes. Another good example of a brick is Air Forces. And I don't have any in hand right now. But Air Forces, you know, everyone has a pair of Air Forces. I'm pretty sure you go to school, you walk around the streets, and, you know, you go to shopping malls. People, you know, you're going to find a pair of Air Forces on someone's feet. So those are the reasons why these are a lot better than hype shoes, in my opinion, if you're getting started. However, the one con to doing brick flipping is that you actually need a decent amount of capital to get started. I started with around 3,000 capital, and it's actually kind of figuring out that it's still not kind of not enough because when you're doing brick flips you want to be actively buying every single day of the month because when you buy it it takes at least a week for the shoe to come in and if you're lucky it might come in the same week sometimes nike ships really fast but most of the time you're going to be buying from places such as hibbits nike and dick sporting goods and they take at least a week or longer if not to come to your house and then you got to get it you know take pictures or post it on apps such as StockX, goat ebay maybe offer up and then it takes time for you to ship it so you want to be actively buying every single day that week because you want to have stuff coming in every other day right you if you buy today and you buy the next day the next week you'll have stuff coming in for two days if you kind of get what i mean now let's move on to the next part of this all right so what you want to download to get the cash back is an app or an extension on your computer called rakuten and basically this is a cashback system where every time you buy at a certain website that's sponsored by this app you're going to get cash back for every purchase now let me show you real quick as you can see, we have Rakuten pulled up on the mobile Safari app. And basically, it'll just teach us how to use it, how to sign up, and all that stuff. If you keep scrolling down a little further, you can see a lot of different websites with actually a good amount of cashback, especially shoe stores like Foot Locker and Champs. You guys see Finish Line, and you're just, but there's going to be Nike at the end. But most of these times, you're going to be buying off shoe websites to get your cash back because you're going to make the shoe have a lower cost so you can make more profit on each one now you guys may be wondering where are you going to find those shoes online to buy where can i find the links to those shoes where can i find uh you know the store and how do i know which shoe will resell for a little bit of a profit now here's where i kind of want to stop this video and change onto a different topic so some of my friends and i are in the same cook group actually it's kind of a brick group now but basically it's a group that we're all in the Discord group, paid memberships and everything. But basically, it comes with slot providers so you can cop stuff online without having to make up on your own and people will run it for you. You also have people giving uh, weekly drop advices and, re and release info so you guys know what place and what time they're releasing. We also give brick links, which is what I'm talking about in this video. And basically, uh, one of my good friends, o. Wilson, he owns a big reselling page. He basically posts links there whenever they come out, basically right away. And you're going to have enough time to check it out. You're going to have enough time to set it up. And then we'll teach you everything 
how to get started and stuff like that because there are things you need to set up such as multiple emails knowing how to create accounts and how to get certain discounts uh without even without using certain codes so if you join this discord group it's actually a really really valuable tool to use as a beginning reseller and it is fifty dollars a month but if i refer you like, you get a discount i get a discount so it's a win-win for both of us like we're i'm paying this amount too like i'm not even an ad in the group i'm a paid membership in the group and i think it's pretty valuable because fifty dollars a month may sound like a lot right and trust me it did to me too but when i realized i could make 10 to 20 dollars a shoe and that means i only had to sell about three to four shoes maybe five shoes sometimes to make my money back and i realized i could do that within a week and everything else after that would be profit i thought it was actually pretty beneficial to pay the monthly fee and this actually doubles as an investment group too because we teach you what kind of shoes to invest in that will actually go up and we have like a 99 percent success rate like all the investments that were called have you know paid off and actually like predicted it actually went up and we actually all made a profit so everyone in the group is actually pretty happy right now but we are looking for new members because if we do get more members that equals to more funding and more funding allows us to allows my friends to make better improvements to the server and provide more tools for us to use now again i want to let you guys know this not a paid promo not a sponsor i'm telling you guys this because i actually thought it was a really valuable tool for when i first started like these guys i known them for a while because before i started reselling i used to buy off these guys right and now that i'm reselling and they're i'm talking to them i realized that they actually are really good people who are willing to help you so i'm only telling you guys this because i think it's worth the shot so if you guys are interested in getting started and you guys have capital sitting around i would just make sure you guys to shoot me a dm at snack god uh llc on instagram or you can dm wc underscore hype which is my resale page about the discord group and i can have you talk with the owner of it and see if you like it or not but one last time this is all in one group improves like bricks investments quick flipping advice a lot of different kinds of advice that you can get into starting and will help you set up and they're actually genuinely there to help you like there's other cook groups out there other brick groups you can find maybe some at a better price but i cannot guarantee they'll be willing to go one-on-one -on -one and help you and make you feel like a real community so that is the main reason why i want to show you guys this today but anyways let's continue with this video okay guys so i know it's been a while since i uploaded my last video also so there are a few things i want to talk to you guys about one of those things is i'm thinking about adding pokemon cards as a part of this main channel maybe i'm gonna start making uploading videos where i unbox pokemon cards show you guys how to invest in some certain cards uh telling you guys what to buy or what you should pick up if you guys come across it in your local stores because i know pokemon's gotten a lot more popular in 2020 and it's becoming profitable from the trading card game and i've been getting back into it like i used to collect it so maybe you guys want to see me unbox stuff and see my reactions on camera and that could be a possibility another thing i want to talk about is giving you an example of a brick flip so here is one of the shoes that came in like two days ago this is the air jordan one woman's multicolor this is the name of the shoe all right so i'll show you what it looks like real quick this is basically what it looks like it's not the best looking in my opinion there's too many different colors and it's a mid which isn't that popular too and it's like got the patent leather so you know what in my opinion i don't know why these are reselling for a decent bit but using links we usually get these for around 100 and 809 dollars and that's how much we pay for them right that's actually under retail it retails like 120 right then on apps like stock x or goat you can actually list them there and post it and i already sold this pair for like 125 so like from that i made like 14 dollars off of that sale already so again like i told you earlier bricks you're not aiming to make a lot of money but you make small money each time but they're really easy to sell and you can buy them pretty easily because there's not like a huge demand for them like hype shoes so this is a good example because i made decent money and each one of them i just aim to make around at least ten dollars as possible if, if possible so this one was a success and i also got two of them so i sold both already and you can see that i sold them in a span of two days like seriously it's not not the hardest thing so if you guys are interested in joining this group just make sure you dm me at snack god so that's snack underscore god and you'll probably find my account i'll have it's like my youtube channel is linked in there and it shows how many subs and how many things i have so you guys should find it fairly easily and you guys will it's a private account so you guys just request it too i'll follow you guys back anyways we're gonna move on to a little bit of more pokemon talk and we'll see what you guys like about it all right so you're probably wondering where this video is going i know i've been jumping between clips at different times of recordings in this video but my main intention for this video was to show you guys what i did to brick flip and i want you guys kind of to follow the same exact model if you guys are starting into reselling sneakers or if you guys are interested in joining a little group that we have to help you get started and then i also wanted to talk about investments checking up on my smoke gray jordan one investment seeing where i paid the price that i paid 
at the time and seeing where the shoes are at now and talking about you know when i plan to sell the shoes and where they're projected to be at next year at this time so on the side note i also got this really cool light with my resale page on it, instagram named wc hype and i got it as an early christmas gift it's actually really cool so you just tap it and it changes colors you know it lights up and sometimes it rotates it and shows by itself but really really cool accessory here i'll probably use it in the back of my post when i do story sales and stuff like that so they're in the back of my closet. I'm gonna go line them up in the middle, middle of the living room and we'll see what we have. All right, guys, so this is the total of what all our investments are looking like so far. These are all smoke gray Jordan ones and Japan's. And I believe that these next year will go up to 350 and plus. And I believe during the Christmas time, they'll also rise up because everyone is trying to buy up shoes as gifts. And because people are buying them, it caused the price to increase. So here we have a little bit over 40 pairs, I believe. And uh, this is gonna be a almost like eight to 10 month investment that started kind of back in like August and September. So we'll see what this takes us next year during the summertime of 2021. Anyways, this is all the shoes and we set up just for Instagram pic over here earlier. And uh, yeah, hopefully these will be worth it. So you guys can see all of them are about GS sizes, kind of like four Y all the way to like six and a half Y on the top. And yeah. All right, so let's go into the pricing of what I paid for the shoe right here. Obviously not this exact pair, this is a men's shoe that I happen to have, but I invested all into GS pairs. So basically sizes like four and a half to seven. I think those were the best sizes I could have went for. And I paid around 230, 240 a pair. Now market is sitting at around 260 plus for each size right now. And some sizes are even going for more than 260, like 270 ish. So, so you can see that I already made around $20 each pair just by having them and sitting in my closet. I don't have too many of these ones. However, I only have about like 20 something of them. So I guess you can say it's a lot, but compared to people who actually do a lot of sneaker investments, 20 something pairs is not that much. And it's actually quite a bit of capital to hold up, but I'm glad they went up really soon during the Christmas times too. If you guys didn't know the time of recording today is December 13th. I had to look on my computer over there, but December 13th. So we have about another week and a half before Christmas time. And this is a really great gift for people that like sneakers are into basketball shoes, Jordans. This is a really nice colorway that can go with a lot of different outfits. So I can see the reason for the price spike and I can see the reason why these would go up definitely, especially the quality on these really, really smooth leather too. And it has a really like smooth suede on it. So I can see these going to be like probably a $300 shoe by the, by like 2021, I would say in March, May, maybe it'd be like a $300 shoe. And then in August or September, it could probably be $350. Who knows? It could be even more, it could be less, but you know what? I trust my intuition on this shoe and I see a lot of people doing it too. So obviously you can't go too wrong with it. And it's already went up, so I didn't take any losses. Just wait my time, put my money down there, and I'm pretty satisfied with the results so far. I wouldn't mind selling it if I it was at 300, honestly. I don't need to wait until it gets to 350. I could make a profit of around $50 to $60 a pair, and I'd be calling it a day. So let me know what you guys think. Like, when do you guys think this shoe will be $350, if it ever will be? And would you sell it early just to get the money, or would you rather wait and use the money for something else later on? So anyways, that's about wrapping it up for this video. If you guys do enjoy, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. I'm almost at 2,500 subscribers. So if you guys could make that happen, that'd be really amazing. I don't know if I'm going to be doing a giveaway for this one because I've done giveaways for like 1,000, 1,500, and I think 2,000. But I don't know if I'm going to do a giveaway for 2,500. It's kind of been really, really slow during quarantine, especially because I can't upload candy selling videos. It's hard to go outside and record videos too. So I'm kind of running out of ideas sometimes. And it's basically just me sitting at home trying to think about what I can talk about next. But I hope this advice really helps you today. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.